They tore my house up and my car. A relaxing early Sunday morning on the porch came to a screeching halt. When it came up through here, it flattened both the tires so he couldn't turn. So he hit, so he ran, he ran into the back of my car, this part. Right here at Washburn and Fullerton, this stolen Dodge Challenger smashed into Alfred Winman's home. I'm sitting right here. I had to jump up out of my seat and run over here. It turns out it was a stolen car out of Ohio. Detroit police tried to pull it over on the city's west side. The driver sped off from police leading to a chase. They crashed. Both men inside tried to get away on foot and were arrested. Allegedly riding shotgun the whole time was an off duty Detroit police officer. Are you kidding me? Off duty? What is he? What was, what was they thinking? That officer was arrested and held for two days after the chase, but released pending an ongoing investigation. Now, after less than two years with DPD, the officer is suspended. It's horribly disappointing. Um, you know, wearing uh, the badge of a Detroit police officer is an honor and a privilege, and it's not a right. There are allegations at this point, but if they're, if they're all true, it's really a slap in the face to the uh, approximately 2,500 people that wear the badge today. We do know the name of the officer, but we're not releasing it at this point unless until he is charged. Detroit police are seeking charges, but ultimately it will be up to the Wayne County Prosecutor's Office. Jessica Dupnak, Fox 2 News.